hello everybody it's the first of December white rabbits and um, I've had uh, <clears throat> a busy old uh, couple of days yesterday I did a couple of um, mixed media videos and um, what did I do Friday oh Friday I coloured some more images in and um I'll just show you i colored that image in a little honeybee and i colored that little girl in that's a connie fong so i've just got cards to make with them um done a bit of reading a bit of crocheting um we're off to see our grandson to meet our new grandson tomorrow uh, looking forward to that and um, as you can see I'm wearing my jumper and knitted so it's a, it's a cold and frosty morning here so um, yeah I've got this on so what we're going to be doing today apart from um, editing and uploading videos I've got uh, the case to pack um, I've got a few bits and bobs to sort out, blog post to sort out for tomorrow, my commenting and uh, it's going to be a really chilled, relaxed day. I'm this afternoon going to sit and watch a, a couple of Christmas movies. I think now that it's December I'm happy to uh, do that and uh, what else was I going to do? I was going to do something else. Oh yeah, um, do some crocheting. Nearly finished my scarf. Um, so I like a quite long scarf because I kind of I have a way of folding it so it doesn't fall off. So, but I want it quite longish, and it's not there yet. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, that's really all I've got to tell you today. Did you buy anything on Black Friday? I didn't. No. We were supposed to be meeting our friend at Cheshire Oaks on Friday. Um, but once we realised it was Black Friday, we didn't go. And we were speaking to our friend yesterday and she was saying that it's a good job we didn't go because it was gridlock. So we're going a week, a week on Monday. I've got a new appointment for my um, Botox for my, you know, dystonic tremor. So I've got that on the 14th. I've got friends coming for a meal on the 14th. So every Monday this month. So mon this Monday I'm, a, I'm at Isle of Man. The following Monday we're at Cheshire Oaks meeting our friend. The Monday after that I'm meeting my best friend, we're doing a Christmas exchange. The Monday after that I'm doing mum and dad's Christmas shopping, Go to mum and dad's. So every Monday from now until Christmas is uh, busy. So just keep me out of mischief. I really naughty yesterday, I bought uh, Rick a, a few more presents. And, and, I finally managed to get my hands on, I'm left-handed and I've only ever used right-handed scissors because they're, for me crafting anyway, they're like gold dust tried to find decent left-handed scissors. Anyway, Tonic and Tim Holtz have started to do lefty scissors. So, I've actually ordered a pair and I'm hoping they'll come soon and I ordered the craft mat you know the lefty craft mat you know where the app anyway I've, I've ordered that as well I thought early Christmas present for myself so I think that's all I've got to tell you today um and it's only what 24 days till Christmas be good everybody 
Hello crafty friends, it is Thursday. It is 20 to 4 uh, on the 5th of December. 20 more days and it'll all be over. Um, what have I done? Uh, Monday, what did I do? Monday and Tuesday we were in the Isle of Man, went to see my grandson. New grandson, he's adorable. Um, Arlo, he's lovely, really a little cutie, um, and obviously Alexander and Layla as well. And Layla started knitting, so was helping Layla with her knitting, which is really nice. Um, she got ta taught how to knit in school, so I was just showing her another way of casting on and how to do pearl stitches. Um, so that was nice, that was nice. Yesterday we did the shopping, um, Rick went to my dad's, I was supposed to go but I had a parcel coming so I had to wait in for my parcel and um, then um, I did six cards yesterday and wrote all the blog posts up and then I sit and chilled last night. I've started making my granny blanket um, with jade so that's coming on okay uh today i went and got weighed i put half a pound on which is not too bad considering i was um over in the isle of man and i had mince pies and i had um naughty 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 food so i'm not too bad half a pound i can live with that and then for the rest of the day i've been down at my friend's jennifer who's another crafter and she's just had um, a stu craft studio built so I've been helping her today sorting out all her uh, dies and stamps and all her crafting paraph paraphernalia so I've been helping her today this afternoon so um, my back is killing me so um, when I've done this vlog I'm going to go and get in the bath and have a soak because my back is killing me um, I'm left handed and I've finally got my mitts on the lefty scissors <laughs> and I got myself um, the Tim Holtz lefty glass mat as well so they're my early Christmas presents to me um, what else have I bought? <laughs> oh dear um, Sheena was on last week and uh, I bought that kit stamps, dies, charisma papers, I bought some ink pads, I bought some storage so I spent a little bit of a fortune so um but some of it Rick's paid for uh for Christmas for me so I'll give him that. Rick's just started um writing all our Christmas cards out um, I will admit that I've bought quite a few this year because I've just not been in the mood for Christmas card making. I've made a few and they'll go to neighbours but for ones that need going in the post I've just... Um, <clears throat> what have I done? I've just bought them. So, But some of the money goes to charity as well so that that's I don't mind doing that because um, if they're charity cards I don't mind buying them. Um, I bought me special ones though, like for Rick and my mum and dad and and that so and little Leslie and Jen. So for me special friend you know specials I, I, I kind of do that. Um what else is there? Uh, uh, I think that's all. Tomorrow I'm going it's housework. I'm going to go down to Jen's tomorrow afternoon and just finish off doing the last bits. And uh, then the weekend I've got DT work to do. Did you see Creating Craft today with ink lily pens? They look amazing. Now I've had to, I had to play with them when I went to Chesterfield in October. So I knew they were coming and I, I managed to have a play with them. Oh my god, they're gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous pens. So <clears throat> I'm just waiting. Uh, I've got um, the parcel that came yesterday is for new secret design teamwork that I need to do. So I'll make a start on that over the weekend. 
and uh, I think that's about all for today. I'll uh, catch you all again on Sunday. Hello everybody. It's Sunday and it's the 15th of December and it's uh, half past ten. Had a nice lay in this morning. As you can tell I'm still um, a bit bunged up. Um, last week was just <coughs> awful. Uh, both Rick and I have had a cold. Oh my God. I've never, I've not been so ill in all my life. Um, didn't go to slimming work, go and get weighed on Thursday. I spent all day in bed. Um, I've been dosing myself up with um, hot toddies and Vicks and oh, God knows what else. Um, I'm just coming to the end of it now, so, but I've still, uh, still got a cough. And, uh, but it is what it is, isn't it? So I've done no crafting at all this week. Um, I did a bit on Tuesday, but I just wasn't, uh, I did a couple of things, a couple of, um, samples, um, secret stuff, and one of them turned out all right, the other one went in the bin. So I've just not been um, well enough to do anything really. So uh, next week is going to be very, 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 very busy. Friday I managed to get all my um, Christmas presents wrapped. So I've just got to get them sent, uh, give them out now. Um, so that's all done, thank goodness. Um, what else have I been doing? Nothing really. Um, went and had my Botox injection yesterday in my neck. Um, you know, for my tremor. And um, so that was done yesterday. And then we came home and did the housework. And um, our friends were supposed to come for a meal last night. But unfortunately, Trudy um, is ill with the, ill as well now, so it was uh, they couldn't come. But I watched Strictly come dance in the final, and Kelvin won. Yes, he what? I mean, they were all amazing, but Kelvin's been my favourite since the first week. So I was absolutely delighted that he won. Is um. Um, all three of his dances were amazing um, so I was well chuffed um, I had a nice lay in this morning didn't want to get out of bed but I thought no I've got um, I didn't do obviously I didn't do a vlog this week because on Wednesday I just I was in bed <laughs> went shopping um, took my dad shopping to him I come home and I got into bed which isn't like me at all. I'm usually, um, you know, usually if I've got a cold, I just get on with it. You know, you just you just do, don't you? Being a a woman, we just get on and do it. But I just didn't have the energy to do anything. So, but I'm feeling a lot better. I'm going to be doing a couple of videos today. I'm going to be picking the winner for the November giveaway. And then I've got my mission inspiration to do for December. So I get all that done. Um, so yeah, um, what have I got this week? This week I've got Monday. I'm going to meet my friend, my best friend, Leslie, for lunch. We're going for lunch and exchanging Christmas presents. Tuesday, Mike and Ian are coming to see me. Isn't that lovely? I can't wait to see them. Um, I speak to Mike near enough every week, so they're coming to see me. And Mr Bentley as well. So they're coming to see me on Tuesday. Wednesday, we're going to see me dad, uh, going shopping, going to see me dad, and then going to see my mum, exchange Christmas gifts. And then on Thursday, I go to Slimming World. And Friday, what am I doing Friday? I don't think I've got anything on Friday. But Friday, I'm, uh, next weekend, I'm going to have to get um, my samples done. So, um, so I've got quite, I mean, I've got quite a busy week. So 
if I get in the craft room before Friday and do any crafting I'll be amazed but it is what it is you know it's the run up to Christmas I mean luckily enough my samples don't have to be in till after New Year but I want them all done before the New Year I want to start the New Year on a, a clean slate so to speak so that's what's going to happen then um, so I'm hoping by New Year's Eve everything's done um, craft room's going to be shut from next Sunday and then there's no crafting then until after Christmas excuse me I haven't got a lot of samples to do but I, I've, I've got quite a few ideas on what I want to do so one of the ideas that I did ended up in the bin so I'm I knew where I got kind of gotten wrongs with that so I'm going to do it again so um, I just uh, have to see how it goes so I'm going to love you and leave you and I will see you all hopefully Wednesday <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear, stand still. No, stand still. There you go. He's drunk, I think. Stay. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes, all that driving wasn't just for um, for no reason. I've come to see Linda over Hello. in Warrington because <coughs> now we're living in in Barnsley. We're not that far away, are we? No, no, so not actually, at all. Actually, a lot closer. So I've come across to see Linda before Christmas. Brought her a little. Christmassy gift. Christmassy gift. gift. We did a Chris, Chris <coughs> excuse me, Christmas present exchange. Yes. So um, Mr. Bentley's come as well. Yes. Oh, he's busy downstairs backing up Linda's cats. Linda's pussy cats that won't come in because yes. of <coughs> Mr. Bentley. <laughs> so yeah, so <coughs> just had a, a little spot of lunch and it's it's quite foggy here, isn't it? It's yes. misty. It's been really misty all, all morning, really. But it was a nice journey. It was a nice drive over. So. At least it wasn't raining because yes, that's the worst. It is absolutely. So yeah, so we're just having a, a play. Well, not a play really. It's just showing me some. Are these pens? Yeah. Yeah. Um, the new ink lily pens. Yes. So ink lily pens, brand new ones they are from. Who's the the maker? Uh, Create and Craft. So it's the TV channel. One, yes. of, the, one of the TV channels here in the UK, and um, just like your Copics. However, a fifth of the price. Yes. And, and there's, what is it, 100 and, 180 colours? 180 pens, and this is what I've done today. Yes. But Before Mike came. Yeah. <laughs> what I like about these is <coughs> dual tip again. So you've got your chisel tip. Um, whereas on the, the square Copic ones, it's a bullet tip. These ones are brush. Mm, they're really nice to yeah. use. And as with so many... Um, alcohol pens that the mm. colours on the end don't necessarily match the colour that's actually inside the pen no. these do mm -hmm. um, some of them do some of them don't it all depends you just have to um, <coughs> have a play with them but yeah so I've done the mushrooms which was is the first lesson um, they're doing um, you've got some colour charts you've printed up yes there, as you? well yeah, yeah. The, so you these get your colour col charts these are the ones that you colour in yourself yes so in the new year Maybe I may treat myself. Mm. Who can say? Yeah, can say? yeah, but they're really nice pens. Mm. Really, really. I mean, I've got the full set of Copics. There's about 360, 367, I think. Yes, yeah, and I'll just turn the camera around so you can see. Look, they're, they're in that big metal case there, look. Uh -huh. So I've got the full set of them, so... Um, well, it's made people feel sick now. I know, sorry. By turning it around that quickly. <laughs> <clears throat> so I've got the full 180 pens and they're really nice and they're set in classes and over the next 15 months we've got um, a class every month on the 11th of every month we get a new class and we've also got the stamps and they're going to go through um, how to create textures, um, blending, um, doing sky, mm. skin tone. Um, blending different colours together so as well. So this is going to be so perfect going to... for people who, um, who have not really done that much alcohol colouring, mm -hmm. who want to get into it. Yeah. Because it's not an expensive 
set of pens to no, get to start with as well. No. Are they doing them individually or are they just yes, in Yes, you can, every month you can just buy the um, colours for that class. There's about 12 pens for each um, class. So, can you just pass me the box? <laughs> so, this layer, the first layer I've used for the first class. Now, this second layer is for the second class so that's two class two three four and five so um mel has actually put the colors together to mel, create mel heaton mel heaton yeah old friend mel. so yes so that um so the next class so this class is going to be mushrooms and then the next Aquamint. class is going to be all about foliage you know, you, yes your leaves and that and you get the stamps as well so cool so on your youtube channel yeah are you going to be doing some projects using the pens in, yes. the, in, in next year next year is uh, next year i'm planning on hopefully doing um, a bit more coloring so once i've um I've kind of mastered the pens well I I mean I'm a colorist anyway so but yeah. the, you need to because they're a different pen well you've got you've got to learn to, how they work yeah, the, yeah. you know it's I like, need to learn how yeah. to it's use like it's it. like it's like when you get a car isn't it yes you can drive two different cars they drive differently yeah you can drive definitely. but yeah you've got to just you know kind of the, learn the nuances yes you know the lights switches in a different place or yeah. you know the windscreen wipers and stuff cool. like that so, so if you're interested then i'll put a link to linda's youtube channel in the description area below this one so pop across subscribe and you know and click the bell icon so you get notified when she puts those videos up next yeah. year so uh, i'm going to um over the christmas period i'm going to sit and um, decide what i'm going to do yeah um plan yeah. next year's but linda is also going to be helping me with the mission inspiration next mm -hmm. year as well so we're going to kind of take it in turns yes. doing the missions next year if i do the main mission linda's going to do the mini if linda does the main i'll, I'll do, do the, the mini. mini yeah yeah so we're going to do it between us so yeah. we've made okay. a start on what we we've got an idea on the changes that we're going to do for next year yeah and it's we've the, been collaborating haven't we we have um so yeah we're hopefully we'll be able to hit the ground running in january yeah yeah so exciting times ahead and hopefully next year we'll get to do now that you're settled into your home we'll finally get to do those yeah. canvases we're still gonna do yeah we're gonna do um flowers on a large canvas the canvas is still under there i've, I've still got mine <laughs> behind the door in, we've in never the... got around to it what we yeah. Mike moving and me having things done around the house. It just well, you never had a new kitchen fitted for one thing, didn't you? Yeah, we so. had a new kitchen, so yeah. And uh, things are just life gets in the way sometimes. They do, but new year, new start. Yep. So brilliant, cool. All right. Yeah. So are you gonna put the kettle on again? I thought. I suppose so. Hello everybody, it's Saturday before Christmas, uh, the 21st of December. It is ten past nine in the morning and um, I'm all done, all done, dusted and whatever. Today I've got my last um, mixed media project for 2019. Um, my videos for the rest of the year are done except for the vlog which will go live um after christmas and um, because that'll be the last friday of the year and um i went to um got weighed i've lost half a pound so i'm really pleased with that considering it's christmas and i've been out for lunches and gosh knows what else um rick and i'll planning I met up with my friend on Monday Leslie we exchanged gifts and had lunch um, went to mum and dad's they're both well gave them their Christmas presents and um, what else did I do what else have I done I've had a busy a, a really busy week Tuesday and I know I did something Tuesday but can I remember what I did I can't remember what I did on Tuesday Oh well, whatever I did, it's it's gone now. 
gosh, I can't, I can't even remember. I know we had something on every day this week. Oh, my Canadian came. How can I forget that? My Canadian with Mr. Bentley came. So my pussy cats wouldn't come near. <laughs> <coughs> so they were out gallivanting. Um, they're out gallivanting now. Rick's outside with Paul, finishing off my wall. Um, the wall's actually, it's just the paving um, up to the wall that they've got to um, sort that out. So it'll all be done for the new year. So hopefully it'll all be done for today. Um, as I said, I've got a couple of videos. I'm closing my craft room on Tuesday where hopefully I'll have all my secret stuff done for the new year. So I want to get that all done for Christmas, before Christmas, get that done. Usually I would have had it done, but obviously I had a week off, wasn't I, when I was poorly. So I've only got a couple more projects to finish off. And then that's all done then. And um, so we definitely want them all done before for Christmas. I'm hoping to finish them off Sunday, if not Sunday, uh, Sunday afternoon. Because Sunday morning I'm going to blitz the house and from top to bottom. Give it a good deep cleaning. Ready for Santa. Get that all done. And then in the afternoon... Um, I'm going to um, think there's a lot of prep work to do and that so I need to get all that done and then I can get them done so I'm hoping by Monday afternoon, Monday um, doing the last of the um, last minute shopping for my dad then take his shopping then I've got my own shopping to do so I'm hoping Monday afternoon it will be all done and dusted then on Mon uh, Tuesday Rick's in work so while he's in work, I'm going to tickle round so it's all nice and clean. And then that's it then. It's Christmas Day. I don't know where this year's gone. It's just gone so quick, but it's been such a mm, fabulous year. It really has. I've been so, so lucky. Um, getting on the design team for Sue. Um, and... Um, I'm part of the team for Ink Lily, which are the new alcohol pens from Creating Craft and they're beautiful pens absolutely beautiful if you watched the video uh, the part of the video before this you will see Mike came and Mike and I did a video and I talked a little bit about it so hopefully um, between Christmas and New Year I'm going to have a really good play with the pens um, I would have had a good play with them when they came but obviously I was poorly and then I I've had secret stuff to do so I need to get that done first so I'm hoping between Christmas and New Year um, I know Rick's working uh, he's off on Boxing Day which is a Thursday which is day of work but he's not working Boxing Day so he doesn't go back to work till the um, Christmas Eve which is a Tuesday so um, I'll, I'll do some crafting I know that but um, but my craft room will be shut from hopefully Monday night when I finish everything um, it will be done then so I don't anticipate crafting on um, Tuesday but that is all depends on whether so I want to have a really good play and um, they're really nice pens and um, I'll uh, just show you what I've done Just bear with, sorry. So they come in, if you watched, they come in um, these lovely boxes. And um, you get um, 60 in each box. And this is from the first lesson, the mushrooms. And they blend beautifully. I really, really do like them. And uh, so I've got three of these. And they're all in, um, there's like 15 classes. So if you go on to create and craft and put ink lily in. And then, 
so I want to have a play and um, um, start and do some charts, you know, of colour combination, you know, what works with what. Because you all know I'm a, um, a, um, a big fan of, uh, well, I've been colouring a long time and I've got the full set of the Copics. So I want to kind of get into playing with them and making some cart, doing some uh, digi images and colouring and that. So I'm really, really excited. I'm, I'm so excited I want to play with them, but I know I can't. I've got to get this secret stuff done first. Um, I will do, um, I'll, I'll just show you one of them actually. They've got a lovely, um, lovely nib. I'll just pick one out, let's see. Uh, I'll pick a purple obviously and you've got a brush nib and it's really really nice um, I did, did tell, tell me what, what they were yeah ideal shopping they're from and um, they're twin markers and you've got the chisel tip as well so they're, but they're lovely to um, I'm trying to think what the it's poly Oh, I can't remember what the flipping tip, the, 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 the nib's made of polychromo, I think, comes to mind. Anyway, so, yeah, so I, I, I really want to play with them, but I can't. I've got to get this secret stuff done. So this morning, I'm getting my last video done for this year, um, apart from the vlog, which will is done you know kind of um christmas eve is going to be the last video uh, of a vlog and then that goes live on the friday which is the 28th and then i've got a giveaway on the 31st and then it starts all again on the uh, let me say wednesday the th third so on the 3rd of january i start recording my um i'll, I'll have my first video out so not sure what it's going to be yet not decided um mike has asked me to um be um an agent for half of the year so we're taking it in turns he does one month i do another month which is very exciting so um, i'm really looking forward to that we've um, it's going to be changed up a little bit so we've been discussing um things like that and um, I'm going to have a new look to my video, uh, my YouTube, a new look to my blog as well. So I'm getting excited. So uh, I've gone for black, black, red and gold. So I'm really, really, really excited about all that. So that's it for today. I'll catch you all again on Tuesday. Well hello everybody, it is Christmas Eve and it is nearly nine o'clock in the morning. I've had a busy morning so far, I've um, done the washing and I've hoovered and I've dusted all round so we're all nice and clean ready for Santa to come tomorrow. Uh, I've just got, I bought Rick a couple of bits so I've just got them to wrap up while he's at work and then I'm done. Um, what have I done since I last spoke to you? I spoke to you on Saturday, I think. So Sunday we blitzed the house from top to bottom, so we give it a good um, a deep clean. Um, and uh, we've had um, a good sort out in that. So that was all. That was that took up most of Sunday, and then yesterday. We did the last minute Christmas shopping and got some shopping for my dad. Then we went to my dad's and delivered his shopping. And then we came home and I had to play with my ink lily pens. I made a few cards but I can't show you because they're going on the blog next month. Um, and today... I've got um, my ironing to do later and I want to get, I've got a couple of blog posts to write, I've got this video to edit and upload ready for Friday and 
that's it then this is the last video for 2019 don't know where the year's gone um i just want to thank you all so very much for subscribing to my channel um i really do appreciate it i've got quite um uh, I've got uh, quite a few um, different yarns for my giveaways for next year. I think I'm already up to, um, hold on, I've got December's going live on the 31st of December and I think I've got January, February, I think I've got January, February, March, I think I've got four months worth of yarn for next year. So um so I'm all up to up to scratch. Um I'm going to be uh on my blog which I'll put the link here on my blog or if I forget to put it here it's in the description box under you know at the top of the underneath the video when it goes live. I, I'm gonna have a sale page and I'm getting rid of all my Tim Holtz stamps, distress inks, distress oxides, the sprays, um, dyes, um, everything Tim Holtz I'm getting rid of. Um, I've got the stamping platform, I've got two different size light boxes which are good for parchment, I've got a parchment bag that holds all your tools. So um, in the new year I'm going to do a sale page on my um, blog, I'm going to get rid of everything. Um, I'm actually going to be downsizing next year and just using, just having the products that I use on a regular basis like all my cadence, my stamps, my ink lily pens, my copic pens because I don't like my colouring and um, so yeah, I'm going to be downsizing because I don't use them and they're just sat there so I'm going to get rid of, I mean I've got all of the um, Distress Oxides, all 60 of them, I've got all the ink, uh, all the Distress Inks and um, some of them I've also got the refills, the re-inkers, so I'm getting rid of everything. And then uh, I'll see what else I'm going to get rid of. So, um, yeah, I'm having a really good clear out. I've already give a, done a clear out late, earlier this year, twice actually. And uh, I've given them all to old people's home <coughs> for their craft sessions for the old ladies. And gentlemen, um, but my Tim Holtz um, cost me a fortune, and um, I'm not giving them away, so I'm going to sell them. Um, so yeah, so I've got sixty, so I'm thinking fifty pound for for the whole sixty ink pads, um, and the distress oxides have hardly been used, and the sprays. So yeah. They just sat there and uh, I'm not using them so so that's my plan for next year. So on that note I want to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Well Christmas has gone by the time this goes live. I hope you all had a lovely Christmas. I will be thinking or I will have thought of people who are on their own. Um, I do. I am conscious that um, quite a lot of my friends uh, live on their own, and um, I'd be thinking of you. And uh, I wish you all a happy, healthy, and crafty 2020. Until next month. Bye bye for now. Happy New Year, everybody. <laughs>